toss a coin to your witcher, a friend to humanity. I <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Convolution. My name's Khan, and episode three of The Witcher time right now, bro. Tiempo de la Witcher, man. We got my brother Sammy over here. He he will actually finished watching episode one and then watched episode two, two titled The Four Marks, which me and Pops watched. Uh, hopefully, you guys have checked out that video. If you guys haven't, the link's down in the description below, as well as up here, so you guys can go ahead and check those videos out before joining back with us for episode three, which is titled Betrayer Moon. Yo, I'm freaking loving The Witcher. If you guys haven't come over to my Discord already, come over there. We can continue talking about, you know, spoilers and stuff, but not too many spoilers because we haven't finished the episode yet, you know what I'm saying? So we're going to be reacting to episodes three and four today, and then uh, hopefully I'll be releasing these before the end of the year. Yeah, hopefully. What did you guys think about episodes one and two? One was too much. Too much. <laughs> too much of one. Like too many things happening at the same yeah, time. That's true. Like, <clears throat> yeah, that's true. And I don't know, like it's the first episode and there's like seven more to come. You put so much battle and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then the number two is like just storytelling. Right. In my opinion, one should have been more storytelling. Mm -hmm. Number two will be more action. Because in one, you bring the action here. Mm -hmm. And then in two, you bring it down there. So. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. But Two was good because I like the storytelling. At least a lot of the things were right. more clear. Right. Yeah. But do you know like how many seasons are gonna be? No. No, I have no idea how many seasons. Yeah. Uh, unless it's, it's gonna be a long season like Game of Thrones, they 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 would have just gone much slower oh. than episode one. Some somebody in the comments will actually uh, Pratik from Discord actually r r let me know in the comments that the timeline for a lot of these episodes is a bit jumbled. So, um, what we're watching right now will get filled in on why it's, they're showing this to us now in later episodes. I see. And this uh, this whole season one, I believe, you guys can correct me in the comments, but I think this season one is based off just the first book. And there's like several books, so each book might be a separate season of the Netflix's Witcher. But, yeah. I don't know, what do you guys think of Witcher so far? Leave your comments down below. As always, if you guys are enjoying watching these videos with us, uh, what are you waiting for? Click that su su subscription button, like, share the video with any other fans of The Witcher out there, or Henry Cavill out there, or freaking, you know, the actresses of Yennefer and freaking Siri out there. They're so uh, uh, wonderful. And with that all being said, let's go ahead and dive into uh, The Witcher episode, season one, episode three, titled Betrayer Moon. Three, two, one, son! A pregnant girl who died before her time. Good job. When he's oh. Shit. Werewolf! That's what I was thinking too. Rips out. Who made it a bit no more? Of good luck. I swear, Witcher, that's what got me. I swear, I saw it. I swear, I'm lost. So are they showing yeah. her like other yeah. Witchers? Another fucking bitcher! I take payment after the job is done. And for a third of the price, <laughs> an apology. Do yeah. And if you can't kill yeah. it, then I die. Yeah, exactly. Come on, you just restart the game from your last save point, man! Hell yeah! <laughs> Shit. Everyone, remain calm. Full test. Commits treason. He hides in his winter castle as we are eaten! You know nothing. Don't Just full test have a plan. See this one to our borders. What? What's going on? Oh, you can put down your sword. I'm not here to hurt you. Says the witch hiding in the woods. Tris Merigold. I serve King Foltest. Isn't Tris a character? Is a daring girl to slip my original plan for a king? Oh yeah, one of his lovers. Yes. 
Beauty will ever make you feel worthy of either. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. The, the two from the picture, remember? Yeah. This is the past. Oh, this is past. Sense. You claim to be quite the artist. Prove it. See? I'll take her as well. She's like, check. We just her whole life. Mm -hmm. Father sold her. Yeah. Sir Father. Don't be foolish. You can't be awake during the procedure. I can. Time, time for extreme makeover. Extreme, extreme makeover. Put yours back. Will my daughter be normal? She said as an animal. Oh, that belonged to Renfrey. If I can, it's a curse. A gift. This isn't my first time trying to save a princess who others see as a monster. <laughs> they brought the freaking general along. Carry me out, I order you. Bro, just stop. <laughs> I recited some silly chant and I bathed in the lamb's blood until sunrise. Ew! Until the rooster crowed. What more can I do? Nothing. Unless you can keep a streak out of her crypt until a fucking rooster crows three times. They don't have to fight it at all. And pick up all the potions for us! Time to use power! To be reborn, you will bear no more. Understand? Oh, so she cannot get pregnant. Yeah. Come back here! <laughs> Please! Oh, shit. I loved your mother. Holy oh, shit! Oh. oh, that's not a tail. It's an umbilical cord. Remember she ripped out of her mom? Holy crap, that is oh. horrific. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Honey, ew! No anesthesia? Oh, oh, damn, nice. Ew. <laughs> Some ancient plastic surgery. Seriously. I'm sure you jump off the top of the Ew. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know there was what was up there! Oh shit, the whole body's like freaking molten! Oh shit, cause he placed the barrier, right? Oh shit! Sunrising! Tackle! Oh shit! Oh nice, nice! Sweet! Oh shit! I can't tell which one is who! Ow! Ah! Seriously. Oh, hey, look at her. That's her body. But she doesn't look like a monster anymore. Right? Yeah, I think she changed. The car's lift off, I guess. Yeah. Oh, she literally looks like Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Newborn with the blinds and stuff. Oh, yeah, good point. Yeah. Really. Armor. I know, he just took off his armor too, damn! So you never take off armor, kids. Damn! Yennefer of Vengerberg. Are you aware that I'm in the market for just such a mage? Yeah. Oh man, Yennefer's gonna get what she wants, but she's gonna make a whole lot of enemies now. You heal quite nicely. Princess! I've arranged for her to stay a while with the sisters of Melitelli. Who's Renfrey? None of your business. Uh -huh. I feel something out there waits for you. I was about to say, so we don't see Princess Ray in the whole episode? Right. She's in like some sort of. She's under a spell or. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dude. 
see that line of dead people out in front of the forest, bro? Oh, Ooh. shit. Wow. Holy crap. <clears throat> okay. So starting off, one thing I really want to state, you know, post this episode, is like, uh, Bob's, you mentioned something about how, like, right after Yennefer transformed, she looked like a baby, right? Like, out of her mother's womb. She sacrificed the ability to give birth, and then she was ultimately reborn in that stance. And I love how they, like, kind of went back and forth between showing her transformation, and then the fight the between, yeah. yeah, that princess, and then <laughs> ultimately they both ended up transforming back into, like, you know, the girls that they were supposed to be initially before Destiny intervened or whatever. You don't know, Yamaka might be supposed to be the way she was. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yo, yeah, right. <laughs> Yennefer <Yeah>, Hater? <laughs> Yennefer yeah, Hater. She, she used magic. She gave up something to become pretty. Right. And beautiful and all that. But if she was supposed to be that way, then she wouldn't have to give up anything. She would only have to give up her hunchback. Yeah. Oh, and the other thing was uh, freaking Foltest and Ada, King Foltest and Princess Ada's affair. But this incest. whole, uh, the way they were saying, the two different times. Yeah. So that's confusing. So it means the whole episode two that we watched yeah. is in the past. Yep, yep. If yep. we think that mm -hmm. what's happening with the Witcher and Geralt but, is in the present. Yeah, exactly. I think that's fine. Because you were saying yeah, she's too the, young. Yeah, she's too young. But that's yeah. Fine. But I, I, I think like um, from like what I've seen, yeah. But I think like if I remember correctly, witchers and mages, like that, like the the teacher, the the um, Yennefer's teacher, mm -hmm. Chisea or whatever, she doesn't look old, right? She looks old, but she doesn't look that old. But I think she's lived decades and decades. decades. I, mean, I think they can use magic, yeah, correct. Like to make, make themselves together. exactly. And I know like the Witcher, uh, Geralt of Rivia, he's. I don't know how old he is, maybe you guys can leave in the comments, but like, uh, I'm sure like, it, it, because of his mutation, they don't age the same way as normal people do, yeah. but... Yeah, because like, on the scenes, they were showing the king and the Ada and Poltres, they're like young kids, 10, yeah. 12, yeah. and the king is like, literally 50, 60 years yeah. old right now, mm -hmm. so... So it's already been like several decades after Yennefer has transformed, so, yeah, yeah. She's in her 50s right now. No, actually she's older because the king is in her 60s. So she's like in her 70s. Yeah, so whatever whatever <laughs> age whatever age the king is, she's say like 10 years older. Because yeah. you know, the kid was still in the ball and stuff. And that was crazy because like uh, Fringilla, I think that was her name. The the um, the the mage who was supposed to go with uh, the king of Adrian. You know, I think her name was Prince, uh, Mage Frangella, and then she was the uh, niece of the, the head of the head, mage. Yeah. And then now he's pissed because his and niece has to now, I guess, go to Nilfgaard. Yeah. Right? Because the, the, nobody else can fill the position. And then you also had that conflict between the Yennefer's boyfriend or Yennefer's, you know, love interest Whatever. and her. And then that just kind of like goes into that whole detail of how they're like just spying on each other. Mage, like the weird mage versus mage versus wizard dynamic that they got in the school which i don't uh, i don't doubt whatsoever of course these professors are spying on each other heck they're turning their students into eels as batteries <laughs> for their freaking mansion place you know uh aretuza as it's so called but um yeah what, what was your favorite episode so far episodes one two and three like uh I would say I would say this one is my favorite just because of the craziest monster fight. Actually, no, episode one had that crazy sword fight, so I don't know. Which man. one is your favorite? I don't know. Two are good as well because they showed I mean, a lot of yeah. the first part, so, mm -hmm. so I, I like that. I, mean, I, you like I, I never that? read the book, so basically. <laughs> I was like, I was like looking at you so judgmentally. You like Jennifer, huh? You like Jennifer? Yeah. <laughs> I don't like her. Oh man, I like old Jennifer. I feel like this new Jennifer is like, like too power hungry. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, this well, is Jennifer. This is her story. Change. Yeah. yeah. Why? Goes, uh, yeah. She was more stable. People well, don't change. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. What do, what do you guys think of Geralt of Rivia as like the main hero so far? Like Henry Cavill. He's better than so, Jennifer. He's better than Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> you were hating on Jennifer so much. Yeah. No, I'm I pretty sure that. a lot of people is gonna hate me because I hate Jennifer. No, uh, no, I don't think that. What were you gonna say? I was saying the, I mean, the whole makeup and the hair. It did look really good. Yeah. They did a pretty good job with his all the whole appearance. Oh yeah, definitely. What I don't like about this episode is like there was no theory. 
Oh, okay. Like only one scene where she walks in. Like I was by right. that time, I was actually wondering. So what happened to Siri? Right. It's it's crazy how they're doing these uh, different episodes because episode one was just Geralt and Siri. Episode two was just Yennefer in the past. And then episode three Which is- Which we didn't know until today. Exactly, yeah. So like, you know, yeah, cause I, I, I heard I heard that the timeline was weird throughout the episodes from um, one of my friends on Discord. But yeah, this episode I think really displays that because you see like Boltis and his sister and stuff. Yeah, but I, I really like the fight scenes. I think like, I, th for this being a Netflix series, I think uh, they're, they're putting their budget in. I just wish the fight was a little bit brighter. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, but it could be that we have the lights on and stuff, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I love the way they're displaying the fights, monsters, magic, and like this political political intrigue with the different kingdoms and setting their mages to like um, advise these different rulers and stuff. So yeah, super excited for super excited for the next episode. And the next episode is titled Of Banquets, Bastards, and Burials. This is BBB. BBB, bro, BBB. You guys ready for Triple B for next episode? What did you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Oh, I was gonna say, Sami can do the ending part. Nah, say, it's okay. say, oh. come on, do it. <laughs> <laughs> Toss you know a what? coin to your witcher. Oh, Valley of I mean, Plenty. You can stop this. <laughs> oh, Valley of Plenty. What did you guys think? Leave your comments down below. We'll see you guys later in season one, episode four of Banquets, Bastards, and Burials. Bye bye. And don't forget to like. Don't forget to and like. Subscribe. And, and subscribe. And subscribe. And share. And all that stuff. See you guys later. And don't forget to toss a coin for your witcher. Bye. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe, hit that like button and feel free to share the video and I'll see you guys.